not convinced by you he in fact he said that uh, i think you were he uh, i don't know the exact words but i think he said that you did not uh, know much about foreign policy matters you needed to learn a little more uh well let me let me put it to you more accurately this wasn't at a parliamentary committee mm. uh abid in parliamentary committees we have interacted but usually what happens in parliamentary committee i try to keep to myself so i will not get into it with you either uh this i think was something he said at some kind of public meeting hmm. somewhere it was that you don't know much about i think he uh, look i i cannot vouch for the exact words either but uh, i think it was probably in the context of china hmm. if china. i remember right yeah he's not convinced uh, about china yeah, that but you know i mean he thinks that you are what, opaque about it uh uh i don't know whether it's opaque or whether uh, you know Uh, there was a sort of a level of knowledge understanding i mean all i can say in my defenses i have been the longest serving ambassador in china i have been uh, dealing with a lot of these border issues for a very very long time mm. uh, i uh, uh, i would say uh, re- re- let me put it to you this way i'm not suggesting i'm the necessarily the most knowledgeable person but i would uh, have a fairly good self opinion of my understanding of what is out there okay but you know i'm i mean if he has uh, superior knowledge wisdom i'm all as i said for me life is a learning process superior knowledge wisdom on china if he has i'm always willing to listen okay and learn from mr rahul gandhi on china if you think that that's a possibility uh, i have okay. never closed my mind to anything however improbable it is <laughs> okay yeah.